I'm Simon from Crooked Imaging, and I don't know if you know, but Photoshop, or Adobe released a new version of Photoshop this week, uh, Photoshop 2020. And in this version of Photoshop, there are some new tools. One of the tools I want to talk to, about, talk to you about right now, though, is the uh, new object selection tool, or Actually, where is it? Um, when we when I installed it, I wanted to try the tool out, and I thought I'd do a quick video to show people how it works. But I couldn't find it. And when I went to the selection tools uh, and the quick select tools, you've got quick selection and the magic wand tool. But also in there should be the object selection tool. But as you can see, it's not there. So I had to do a bit of quick bit of research to find out why, where, or how to get it to work. Uh, and it does look like there is a bug in Photoshop in the new version that, for some unknown reason, doesn't put it into the toolbar. Uh, so what you need to do is we need to go to Edit. Go down to toolbar. Let me just pull that across there. So edit toolbar. And you will see down here the quick selection tool, magic wand tool are there. Now I have already run through this uh, tweak. So this will look different to what you will see. Um, the object selection tool doesn't show under the extra tools until you press the reset do defaults. So it seems to be that the bug um, doesn't put the tool anywhere until you hit restore defaults. And once you do that, you will then see down here, you've got the quick selection tool, magic wand tool, and the object selection tool. Now you can move around the order that these, that these show up on the menu. Um, when you hit the restore defaults, it may require you to update your toolbar to how you like it because it will restore all the defaults and puts all the tools onto that uh, that toolbar. Once you've hit the restore defaults, hit done, and then you will see that when you right mouse click on your selection tool, you will now see that there is an object selection tool in there. Now, I haven't actually tried it. Um, I have an image here. I believe you draw a box around what you want to select. And then the AI within Photoshop will then select the object. And as you can see, it has done a pretty good job, actually, of selecting around the edge of that mushroom. Uh, down here is going to be a little bit difficult, um, just purely because of the uh, the contrast and everything of uh, of the picture. But as you can see, it has done a pretty good job here. You know, if I chop that out, you can see that it has done a very good job, and only with one click. Whereas with, obviously you've got the quick selection tool, it's pretty good, um, but would probably have required a few clicks to uh, to do that. So there you have it. I will go through, I'm going to have a, a play with the quick selection tool, uh, sorry, the object selection tool, and do a video on that. But uh, but I just thought I'd do a video just in case you wondered where it was. As I say, had me stumped for a little while. Um, so there you have it. Hit that uh, subscribe button, like button. Um, any comments you have, just, just let us know. Um, but if you want to see any videos on Photoshop, also put it in the comments below and uh, we'll see what we can do. Okay, I'll speak to you soon. Bye for now.